Joined by Coast Guard Head Coach Mike Bynum following a 3-2 loss to WPI Coach. It seemed like WPI was going to come in here and roll. They had won the first two games, but you guys really answered back to, to get to a fifth game. We played one of our best matches last season against them at their place, and we knew that they were going to give us a tough time tonight. Um, we identified a lot of things that we had to do well early. We didn't. Kind of battled back a little bit. I don't think either side played well. I don't think it's one of those games where either coach walks away saying, we played an awesome match. And... You know, we talked a lot about just trying to gut it out and, and, and do the right things on our side of the net when things weren't perfect. And this sport really lends itself to being sloppy and, and making a ton of errors. And we were just trying to limit those. And when we did, we did well. And when we didn't, we struggled. Um, but they were a great team. I thought that they did some really good things um, as a coaching staff to kind of exploit some of the things that we don't do well yet. Um, and uh, it, was, it was a great match. Coach, I mean, another five-set match. You guys have made a, uh, a living of doing that. I think it just goes to show the toughness of this league and the toughness of your non-conference schedule. Yeah, we, we wanted to really challenge ourselves. Um, we knew we were going to be an inexperienced group, and why not just kind of throw them into the fire and see what we could do. And we've, we've answered. <laughs> we've been down early. We've been up early. You know, pick whatever scenario you want. We've been in it so far in just, in just 10 matches, and that's exactly what we wanted. And I think that... Um, our league and the things that the coaches and the players that are do, they're doing recruiting wise and I think just in terms of teaching their kids and training their kids are just incredible. Um, you know, the top has come up, um, the top, top teams have gotten better, the bottom teams have come up to the top and it's a battle in the middle. I mean, teams like WPI, um, us, Clark, Wellesley, Emerson, those teams, those are huge matches for tiebreakers as it gets into the, towards the end. And it doesn't get any easier. You have your, your neighbors from Con College coming across tomorrow night for a big match. Yeah, another team. This is our third team this week that we beat last year, that we knew, and we have to kind of defend, defend our home gym and uh, get another chance at it right away tomorrow. And uh, they're a great program. They, they do a great job with their Patty Genitazio, who there's assistant, knows exactly what this place is all about. And uh, she loves coming back here to play. And we, we're really excited, again, to play just another great team, another NESCAC team who was also battle-tested in their conference. And it's always great when teams from those two conferences get together. All right, Coach, thank you. Thank you.